Army lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Boston College's coaching staff, they know they've got a star wide receiver. They know it's going to be a hostile environment. With that, we went to practice this week, Kirk. They had a crowd noise pumped up pretty good getting them ready for this game. Yeah, they've done everything that they can do to get this offense ready for a tough environment. They had the crowd noise all week long, making it tough to communicate for the quarterback and his receivers. Now it's here. Now it's the game. And we'll see if all that preparation pays off. One thing we know for sure, they want to get the football into the hands of this receiver early and often if they want to win this game. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. Let's go! Let's high five! Let's high five! Quick pass. Brought down the 35-yard line. Call it a game of four yards. That will be my third and inches. made at the 45 yard line to be successful you've got to be able to come through on third down and that's just what they did with that big run from their own 45 yard line first down Let's go. and he's tackled at the 47 that'll bring up second and three Defensive coordinator standpoint, it can really help out your scheme when you get excellent run support by the corner. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. Three down, three down. Hey, check Mike, check Mike, Mike. Let's go! Makes the catch and look out. They'll bring him down to 39 yard line. He looked pretty cool back there. Even with the outside linebacker blitzing, he made an accurate throw, and the result is a new set of downs. Three down, three down. Mike six. Mike three. Red 18. Gains his way to the 30 yard line. Call it a gain of nine yards. That brings up second. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. complete he's got room to work just another weapon for this offense he's got good hands and he's tough to bring down he showed right there that he can make something big happen we're at play number nine of this current drive he makes his way out to about the 12. that makes it second and two It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. And he's taken down at the 12. It's the 11th play of the drive. Tackles him hard at the 10. And the short gain is enough for the first. And that tailback definitely has a nose for that first down marker. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. Nice run, and he's brought down. That brings him second. And this is the 13th play of this drive. So here we go. It's third and goal from the two yard line. Quick strike, tight end, and that's a touchdown. How about the 
tight end. This guy can play some football. You bet he can. He's such an all-around player. He's just as good at blocking as he is at catching the football. And he hits the PAT. So a 14-play, 76-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. So our score, 7-0. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. He makes his way out to about the 35. And they make the stop at about the 35. He gets out to about the 38-yard line. Gets to around the 42. He got the ball and he was off like a shot. This guy has some big time speed. So the quarterback keeps it on the option, but he'll lose a yard. That'll bring up second and 11. From the 43 yard line, it's second down. He's coming, check him, check him. So at the end of one, Boston College leads seven nothing. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. I'm trying to collect. Ready? Run. Tackle at the 41-yard line. They attempted to pick up the first by running it, and they failed. Yeah, and the defensive line won that battle easily. He doesn't want to touch back here. He wants to knock this ball inside the 10. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Boston College is up seven. Makes it to the 22-yard line. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on their own 22. Ready. Black. Black. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. They complete that play action pass. Good for seven yards. Tight end does a good job here of selling his block and then getting out on his route and then making a nice catch for a good game. It's third down, and this offense is about three feet away from that first down marker. Ready! Flag 68! Slings it, and down he goes at the 48-yard line. I like the call here by the defense to bring the heat with the outside linebacker. It was just a better call by the offense, and that's why it's a first down. Job by the defense to overpower the offensive line and drop the back for a loss. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 47 yard line. And he's going to be. 
be sacked for a loss. The pressure got to him that time. Well, they brought the heat here, and the linebacker was able to spring free for a big play. Boston College is up a score. He's got to throw it in a hurry. Great job back-to-back -back plays by the defense. This guy's got experience. It'll take an awful lot to unsettle him. The sack makes this a fourth and very long. Booming kick. And he's taken down at the 24-yard line. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. And he's tackled after positive yardage. He tackles him for a loss. They don't get back to the line of scrimmage there on the option keeper. A loss of one. That'll bring up third and six. From their own 29-yard line. Third down. 34's the mic. 34's the mic. He's coming. Check him. Check him. They go with the run, and he's taken down behind the line. One-yard loss for the halfback. Fourth down. They've got 10 guys up. They're coming after the kick. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He's tackled at the 31-yard line. The Eagles offensive staff, I think, has done a good job of keeping their wide receiver in the game, even though he's not having great stats. He's part of it, and the rest of the team now is picking up his slack at that. But this offense is still putting points on the board, and I think at times they're actually using the wide receiver, the go-to man who's drawing so much attention. Really as a decoy, open up other avenues of this offense. We've seen other receivers make some plays. They're running the football. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of adjustments this defense makes to try to slow down these other members of this offense. And who knows, maybe that could open it back up for that marquee receiver. From their own 45-yard line, it's first down. Boston College up seven points. Pulls it in, first down, and he's knocked out of bounds. reading the coverage and delivering a very catchable ball and allowing his receiver to come up with a nice gain. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Tackled in the open field. That's, That's good, good for a gain, for a gain, of, four gain of four yards. yards. First down. Three down, three down. Three down. Mike six. Get him, baby. Mike six. Set. Flags. And he's level at the 36 yard line. Boy, Brad, that was a big hit on the quarterback. I'm going to be interested to see how he responds from this hit and whether or not he comes after his offensive linemen and challenges them to start playing a little bit. Just throws this one away. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. He gets hit out of bounds around the 33-yard line. That makes it fourth and long. 
Boston College is up by a touchdown. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he got it. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. A really a defensive battle going on right now so far, Kirk. Well, the defenses are flying around the football, doing a good job. I think both offenses are making it a little easier because of their style of game plan. I think well, the offensive coordinator, take a few chances. Be willing to open it up and try to give your quarterback a chance to make a play. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Caught with room to work. He's to the 40. He's taken down at the 49-yard line. The fullback is a safety valve for the quarterback most times. So it's pretty reassuring to know you've got a safety valve as talented as this guy. Now he's scrambling. That's a great tackle at the 44-yard line. The quarterback didn't see anybody open downfield, so he took it himself and picked up some decent yardage. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He's tackled at the 25. Incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. Can't blame him for not hanging on to that pass. He got hit pretty hard. He scrambled. And he's sacked. He's going to try and scramble. Brought down around the 25-yard line. That's a gain of two. Fourth down. They're going to try a long field goal here. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. The kick is up. It's got the distance. And he nails the long field goal. Defensive dominance through two quarters of play. We go to halftime. The Eagles in front, 10-3. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. We've been looking forward to this game all week, and it has lived up to billing. A close game. You feel like that it's going to be a great second half, and boy, we've got the perfect guys in the booth. What a reward today for Nestler and Herb Street to get this game. Well, you know, it's not a secret, Reese. They get the best game every week that we think's on the schedule, right? So they got this grave. It's great. It's close. It's going back and forth. I mean, what a treat to watch one of the best games of the year just unfolding in front of us, and more importantly, to hear the silky smooth sounds of Kirk Herbstreet and Brad Nessler. Does it get any better? David's ready to get back on that couch, get the remote, get all the games dialed up to watch what's going on around the country. Time to get you back for your second half. Brad and Kirk, ready to roll. All right, Reese, David, thanks guys. Just about set to start the third quarter. Excellent kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He fights forward to about the 26. That brings up second and nine. From their own 24-yard line, third down. By 
fires to his fullback. No good. Can't ask for much more than a three and out. Great job, defense. Was the intended receiver on the play. That brings up fourth and 11. Everybody up close. It looks like they're coming after this kick. He really got a hold of that one. Tackle at the 44. Made a few guys miss on his way to a quality return. It's a new possession for this offense, so what will it hold? Boston College is up seven. He's pushed out of bounds at the 49. Seven-yard scamper on the keeper. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Quick strike to the receiver. Tackle made at the 46. That's a game of three on the play. That'll bring up third and inches. And he's tackled at about the 37-yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 37-yard line. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. That makes it second and six. Six-yard line. Number 23 brings him down at the 26-yard line. First and 10. First Ball on the 26. Larry, Larry, Larry. Hey, check Mike, check Mike, Mike 6, Mike 6. Ready! And he's taken down at about the 25-yard line. That's a D. That brings up second and nine. Boston College is up a score. And they get the sack. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. Third and long here, and they hope to convert another one and keep this drive going. Dropped it, but the safety put himself in a position to make a play. That's impressive. Boston College can make this a two possession game with this field goal. It's up, looks long enough, and he splits the uprights. Kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. You know they'd like to do something a little more than they did on their last drive when they had to punt the ball away. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. He stopped behind the line. The quarterback tried to do a little too much by himself. Hey, maybe next time he'll get it out to the back so he can do something with it. From their own 23-yard line, second down. Let's go! Red and they make the stop at the 22. The thing about the option is you're going to have some negative plays. But if you keep running it, it'll create some big play opportunities. They'll 
wrestle him down in the backfield. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 48-yard line, it's second down. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do a much better job of being able to read that defense and make quicker decisions. And especially when the defense starts to get pressure, you've got to either get rid of that football or check it down or take off and run with it. And down he goes at the 43. This punt, if he gets it where he wants, it can really change the field position of this football game. And here's the, wait a minute, the up backs got it. Unable to convert on fourth down, and the ball changes hands. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. From their own 42-yard line, second down. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. And he throws it away. tailback on the screen and he shoved out of bounds around the 45 yard line That'll bring up fourth and, nine. and they're coming after this punter there's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now they don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. That makes it second and ten. Mike 34, Mike 34. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Sack on the big handoff. It's a big time effort sack by the defensive end. I want to also give some credit to the coverage downfield. The end never gave up on the play, but because the quarterback didn't have anywhere to go with the football, it gave the defensive end enough time to eventually chase the quarterback down for that sack. That's three down and one to go. The Eagles with a 10 point lead. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Give me that ball. Give me Let's that go. Ball. Run hard. Fires out to his wider, and he tackles him hard at the 48. That was actually pretty good defense, but a great pass and a great catch were enough to overcome it. Decent run here, right side. So the quarterback keeps it for about seven yards. And they hit him in the backfield. Good discipline here by the defense, stringing the option out and plugging the running lanes. Have moved them back. From the 48-yard line, it's third down. Tries to buy some time. Passes it 
to the middle of the field. He's hit and taken down. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Fires to his receiver, first down. He's taken down at the 37. Number six makes the down. First down. From the 37 yard line, first down. Here's a handoff, left side. They'll knock him down for a loss. It's never good for a back's confidence to get tackled for a loss. But this guy knows that he's got to just keep at it, and the holes will start to open up. Got it. He's tackled at the 33. He ran a good-looking route and picked up positive yardage. That he did, and he made a good catch. That short passing game is where you see all those hours in the summer that you put in pay off. Third down, and they need to get it to the 27. Looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. Just under three to go in regulation. Kick is up, and he just drilled it from long range. Boston College, the kick. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. And he's immediately tackled. into this game. That was a big play, and on first down, no less. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 43. Caught out of the open. Tackle made at the 30-yard line. Just over a minute left. Strike to the fullback, incomplete. Number one was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second. Second down, ten. 10 to go. Ball on the 30 yard line.
Here comes the pressure. And he hits him hard at the 21-yard line. for this defense. They come up with the stop of the ball game and maybe the season. They'll come back out with some confidence from having put through the field goal last time. And he's level at the 38-yard line. Sometimes when you've got speed, that's all you need. It's the one thing you just can't defend. It's first and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. 59, feel it. He's at midfield. Makes it out to about the 50. If you can consistently run effectively like this, it'll force the defense to pay more attention to the run, and that creates chances in the play-action passing game. And they get nice yardage on that run. Army's out of timeout. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. And he'll just take a knee here to kill the clock. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 40. Makes it to the 34. You know that saying, get your keys out because we're on a drive? This offense right now is on a drive. I mean, it, this is their third first down. They're doing just about anything they want, and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down. Boston College's team right now aware that they are a team. Hey, their star didn't shine today. Everybody else picked up the pace, though. I think we all came in expecting to see that star player really shine. And, and the fact that they didn't have a great game from him and still won the football game, boy, I walk away from this game as a viewer just thinking even that much more about this team than maybe what I thought prior to the football game. 